He lives for the snow. When we brought him home as a puppy, we noticed he was a little unique. He'd only circle clockwise. And we discovered very early on that he was having seizures. He would just stop and he would just look to one side and he would just start drooling and be twitching the whole time. What we learned later on is these were called focal seizures, so they're centralized to a certain area. And it wasn't until once he got older, it was causing bigger seizures. Turns out he was born with hydrocephalus and a brain lesion. Along the way, we've made an impact on other people whose dogs have seizures when there wasn't really one for us. He's on three different anti-convulsants. Outside of the seizures, he is kind of a wild man. There's two things a storm loves most in this world, and one is the snow, and the other is the car. During the winter, this dog comes alive. He lives for the snow. We make little snow piles for him to lay on. So usually, our very first snowfall, it's usually just like a dusting in the initial times. But as soon as there's a dusting, like we take him potty in the morning and he sees snow, we can't get him inside. He's doing circles, he's doing laps, he's sprinting, uh, he's rolling in it. And he does what we call little fox dives. Uh, it's where he's just running and then he just whoop, dives nose first into some of the snow. But yeah, you can't get him inside. He just goes crazy in the yard, does circles, rolls around. And the whole time he's rolling, he's growling and making happy dog sounds. Sometimes we forcefully have to break him in. He likes his routine. He's very stubborn, very opinionated. If he wants something, he will make it known and obvious, very obvious. His favorite snack is bell peppers. The orange ones specifically, he gets one once a day. I think the best thing about Storm is he sees something that we kind of dread and he's so excited and it makes us excited.